Hello everyone, Chopper Gaming here. Welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to talk about two of the most important pieces that you need to be unlocking, especially if you're looking to a way on how to be saving your resources and at the same time not to be falling behind. Make sure to be watching till the end to know exactly everything around these two pieces I'm going to talk about today. And let's just jump into it. The two pieces we're talking about today going to be the two new ones that have just added which is the steel judgment as the first one he will be helping out to lower the cost of the food and water for the research by three percent and that's only by making the beast to level 26. when you evolve this skill like as an example for now I'm going to be upgrading this skill now it become six percent lower and even when I'm making him orange one star, I can be upgrading it even more. And then it will be 9%. And it will be increased until the max, which is 15% less cost for the food and water into upgrading. Well, it's more. Wait, yeah, I'm sorry. It's more focusing on the research food. So the food and the water cost for the research will be lowered by this 6%. And it's increased with time. After you upgrade the skill of course. And also. Not just that. But also the steel and the oil. Going to be as well. Lower the cost for that one too. So this one is basically. Focusing on lowering the cost. Of the research for all. The four material you're using. The steel. The oil. The food and water. So this is a too important skill for him to be upgrading as soon as possible once you're able to upgrade it because it will be helping to save a lot of resources and also for the third skill which is the ranged defense his passive helps out to be increasing the defense for the ranged units by four percent and that's only when you have this one activated with time up upgrade this skill will be giving them even more defense which will be helping you over all to be making more progress and also for the battle skill or the exploration, it's really that not that bad, especially because he deals damage equal to 78% of the attack to all enemies. And then he will be dealing as well the damage by ignoring 25% of their defense. So he's helping out to be making things easier. But still, this beast is mainly focusing on the research cost saving. That's more what I'm looking to. He's a top tier piece for the research and saving the resources. The next piece we're going to talk about going to be the Cruiser Razor. And this one here, he's helping as well by lowering the cost. But this time, it's for the constructions and the city building. The first skill he got here, the steel gathering speed going to be increased by 20% and that's because I'm having this one level 2. Once you have the beast to level 26, it's 10% and that's just a passive. So it's working with any type of uh, gathering for the steel and the oil as well. The next passive going to be the lower the cost of the steel and the oil for the constructions as well as the city building. So anything in the building, upgrading, and so on, it will be just making it lower by 6%. And it's even the same, it's a max by 15% when you have the piece to red 2 star and upgrading the skill to the max level. And the third skill going to be raising the fighter defense by 4%. And that's only when you have the beast or the skill activated when you make him level 76. And it's, of course, even more by upgrading the scale and upgrading the uh, the star level of the beast. For the exploration, he's also helping out by dealing damage and reducing the attack to the beast that is against. And also, he raised the attack by 10% and the max is 30%. And also, his basic attack increased by 25%. So that's a really, really great one. These two beasts, I can say they are extremely great to be going for, especially if you're focusing on the long progress about saving your material as well as 
the research cost to be having it lowered, it's really going to be helping you out big time. They are a top tier for the resources gathering as well as saving. I'm sorry for delaying the tier list for the, uh, the piece. It's not really something easy for me since I'm not really used to be making tier lists. I usually just put them aside. So I'm trying my best to round it. I hope I will be able to make it, to be honest. But hey, at least we both have in everything in our hands and there will be more guides about special beasts and everything like that around the game to be giving you a heads up or everything. Make sure to be liking the video, subscribe to the channel and write to me in the comments what you're thinking about these two beasts if you have any other beasts that you think they are really in the same worth like this. I'll be more than happy to hear your opinions. Till then, take care and enjoy your game and don't forget subscribe to the channel.